السلام عليكم ورحمه الله وبركاته كيف حالكم حبايبي ان شاء الله طيبين رجعت لكم من جديد وحشتوني اخيرا بعد غياب ثلاثة شهور رجعت لكم مقطع حصري ودسم اول شيء اعتذر على القطعه ثاني شيء حبعدكم بعوده قويه ما لها مثيل موضوع حلقتنا اليوم عن مراجعه وتقييم مقابله ابطال ونجوم الفيلم الجديد لنتفليكس سلامبرلاند Are you uh, excited for your first day of school? My dad thinks schools are basically prisons. School is not a prison. Can I leave whenever I want to? It's a little like a prison. My dad and I lived in a lighthouse. But now he's gone. Pig. <laughs> What? <laughs> Your flip? He told stories about you every night. We're going on a little treasure hunt. This treasure lets you wish for whatever you want here in Slumberland. I could see my dad again. فيلم المغامرة والفانتزي سلامبرلاند من بطولة جيسي مومو، مارلو باركلي، كايل شاندلر، كريس أوداود، وروتشي أوبيا. ومن إخراج المخرج العبقري فرانسيس لورنس اللي أخرج سلسلة The Hunger Games و I'm Legend. وقصته عن بنت صغيرة يتوفى أبوها. فتكتشف خريطة سرية لعالم الأحلام سلامبرلاند بمساعدة شخص غريب الأطوار تعبر الأحلام تهرب من الكوابيس على أمل إنها تشوف أبوها من جديد طبعا الفكرة مأخوذة من الأنيميشن ليتل نيمو اللي توقع نزل في عام 1989 حاجة زي كذا لكن غيروا في كم حاجة فيلم فانتزي وعائلي تشوف فيه عالمين مختلفين عالمنا الواقع اللي مفروض علينا ونمشي عليه وعالم الأحلام اللي إحنا اخترعناه أكثر شيء استمتعت به في الفيلم هو التصوير والألوان والمؤثرات البصرية المستخدمة والكيمستري الرهيب بين الممثلين كان مميز في هذا الفيلم لأنك حتشوف دراما قوية كوميديا ممتعة في نفس الوقت وطاقة ومشاعر حلوة ورسالة إيجابية وغالبا راح تخليك تدمع والفيلم باقي ما نزل وراح ينزل عندكم بتاريخ 18 نوفمبر على منصة نتفليكس وأخيرا تقييم الشخص لفيلم سلامبرلاند هو 7 من 10 والآن أسيبكم مع المقابلة I have some questions about Slumberland the upcoming Netflix movie and first question goes to Kyle Chandler we saw you in the Wolf Wall Street Godzilla, King Kong, Argo And the Super 8, so and so many movies, and now Slumberland. Every single movie has its own experience. What was your experience in this movie, Slumberland? The reason I chose to do this movie, the reason I was excited to do this movie, is when I read the yeah. script. It was the heart to the movie, and I caught myself getting very emotional with my scenes with my daughter. Um, it's a, it's a moving it's a moving heart for a young lady like like Marlo, who's so fantastic in this. And uh, you know, it's a story of, of the resilience against grief, and the, and it's a beautifully made film. Uh, it ended up so fantastic. I've spoken to so many people that are um, are, are not amazed. Just that their their kids don't want to leave the room, uh, and not everyone's seen it yet. But the people who have seen it that I've spoken to, they also enjoy it very much. So it's all those aspects of this film that that make it very exciting, and I think it's going to be a I think it's going to be a really big hit, as well as and I think some of the reason people like it is for performances like these two guys next to me. I'm just guessing. <laughs> Great, uh, Chris O'Dowd. I watched Slumberland, and I was amazed by your character. So what was the hardest thing you faced when you took the role of the uncle? Uh, <clears throat> I played kind of an awkward character who has to take in this girl and I suppose what I found tricky is, is I wanted to feel as awkward as possible and for her to feel slightly uncomfortable and that's not necessarily my normal personality so I tried to make it icy and for the whole situation to feel like there was nothing going in her favour. And I think it adds to it. And then you kind of open up after a couple of weeks and you bond. And that was exactly what they were doing in the film. So that was tricky to start off with, but uh, I really think it paid off. Yeah, you did a great job. And by the way, you made me tear up. Ah, thanks very much, I think. Thank you. Uruchiopia. Uh, when I saw Agent Green for the first time, it reminded me of many black characters. So tell me a little about uh, Agent Green. Um, Agent Green is a powerhouse, bad, 
I don't know if I'm allowed to say that word. <laughs> ASS woman. <laughs> um, I did. I did. Yeah, no. Spanish. I mean, I don't know. Um, I actually drew two inspirations for her. I was being Pam Greer. Yeah. Who we all know, the original badass. I don't know if I'm allowed to say that. And Denzel Washington, actually. I don't know how I combined the two. But those were the characters I was thinking of when I was trying to be her, mostly Pam Greer, because, you know, we've seen her in films, Foxy Brown and stuff, where she is this, you know, commanding presence. And I was like, I needed to be that in order to be someone that um, Flip, Jason Momoa, would be scared of. I had to be definitely someone with a lot of attitude and a lot of power. And I think Agent Green is a big afro of all that stuff. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you guys for, uh, for your time. I hope you have a great day. I really enjoyed it. Yay, uh, thank cheers, you. Mom. Thank you. Have a nice day. طبعا حاب اوجه شكر خاص لنتفليكس انهم اختاروني عشان اعمل مقابل مع نجوم ابطال الفيلم ان شاء الله تكونوا استمتعتوا بالفيديو زي ما وعدتكم انتظروا الشيء القوي اللي راح اسويه هنا ولا تنسوا اللايك والسبسكرايب والشير كان معكم عبد العزيز خوجه واتمنى لكم يوم سعيد سلام